boys and girls, cats and squirrels. Today we're playing Call of Duty Zombies Gun Game on BO3, BO5, aka Cold War, and Roblox Zombies. So if you guys enjoy the madness of gun game and zombies, leave a like, sub, and comment down below. And let's get into it. So, we just gotta get Elims. I'm playing on a Noah J custom map, essentially. This was made for his mapping contest, so... Ooh, the Elkar 9. Custom weapons, custom everything. Oh, and I can fall off the hedge, good. I thought I couldn't for a second, I was very concerned. And we'll just open this up here. I guess I can get a gobble gum, but it's not gonna help me, because I'm playing with just base gobble gums. So, that's pretty, pretty sick nasty, you know? This is a cool little map here, though. I've never seen anything look like this. Like, in actual Mario Galaxy. But we're on round three. Gun four out of 30, 47. Oh, it's low grab here? Kind of feels like it. That's interesting. Ooh, the Winchester. That thing sounds like a beast. Holy crab apple. I'm happy that I get this. Oh, power switch, power switch. Power's on, boys and girls, cats and squirrels, we did it. We've won already. Observatory has power, I don't even care. And, bang, we now have the WA 2000. Now, I don't usually play BO3. I'm actually a huge casual when it comes to BO3. So, I'm sorry to tell you guys that, but it's not really my game. It wasn't around during its life cycle, so I don't have the fond memories like everyone else. I'm a Cold War player, which is why I know about Cold War even having a gun game in the first place. And I was gonna play some Roblox gun game, which is why, in the first place here, I'm gonna play Roblox gun game. And all these other ones. So, can I do anything with this? No, I don't think so. Cool. I don't think I'm going to be doing any easter eggs, but Cold War Gun Game, you can't even do easter eggs. It's called Mystery Munitions. It's on Onslaught. It's pretty dog water. Just like a lot of the rest of the things in Cold War, at least to a lot of people. I think Cold War is a good game, so don't at me. But yeah, it has plenty of flaws, and I will stand on the hill that the flaws are fine. Every game has flaws. BO6 will have flaws. BO3 has flaws. Everything has flaws, including Roblox Zombies. Now, you may be wondering, why did I pick Roblox Zombies and not Fortnite Zombies? The two, you know, big things. Everyone knows about Roblox Zombies and Fortnite Zombies, of course. Uh, of course they don't, but... Like, I don't know, I just think Roblox Zombies is better than Fortnite Zombies, because Fortnite Zombies is 90% of the time a terrible experience. But let's just keep getting through these weapons and getting through gun game. We got a double points, which is changing the game. This gun game is based off points alone. So essentially just getting double points expedites this progress tremendously. But we're currently inside the, you know, one area of Mario Galaxy. I can't remember what this one's called. It's pretty irrelevant. I get through it so fast. I don't really care. But, yeah. We're just chilling. It's like Gersh's, essentially. Or Kazmir's, if you're a Cold War player. That you go into as a portal. And just run around. Oh, crab apple. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to look and see if it would show me the actual... Oh, no. I hit that. It's teleporting me again. No! I, I was looking to see if it would telling me the brother ain't no flipping way like if there was any like things i needed to oh another double pick up on the map so i was in that one over there the fountain that's what i was in there we go i got it eventually so i've taken my first down because i got the ranger this gun is dog water um yep that's about it i was gonna maybe get double tap or something but i now need to get Quick revive. Oh no, I got double swiped there, and I might be dead. This would be pretty, pretty downtrodden way to die. I'd rather not. It won't let me aim in with this thing. That's why it's terrible. That's why it's terrible, eh? I'm gonna grab quick revive. You might say, how the heck did you down when you had a freaking Widow's Wine and Vulture's Aid combo of dreams? Quick answer, I'm dog water.
Dog, I need to get my controls right. I'm hitting control to slide, and it's making me go prone instead. So let's go here right now. To move, hit toggle prone, and change that to toggle crouch. I think that'll work a lot better. It will at least not insta me. I'm gonna yoink speed cola here, just cause maybe it'll give me a chance to, like, actually do anything. And this guy in the vulture aid is done zo bunzo. We will keep moving. Hopefully not fall off the map. And maybe I can live. You know, maybe. I wonder what's in this area. Maybe we'll know someday. In the bedroom? Never been there with a woman before. I'm a zombies player, dog. What do you expect? I'm getting hit from the back! No! Oh, no. Oh! Jump! Bang! 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 I trained, actually, for once. Like, I trained zombies well. Not terribly. But if one shot from the Model 1887 doesn't one shot these zombies, I'm gonna cry. Bro, did they remove the free one up back here? Aww, that's wild, bro. You can't be doing that to me. I'm dying, I'm dying. I'm dying at an alarming rate. I teleported somewhere, don't know where. I'm in the kitchen. This is not where I want to be, I don't think. Oh, but I can fill up this guy. Maybe that'll give me something. It gave me death. I guess we're moving on to BO5. Now that we're in Cold War, let's quick grab our free bundle. So cool, so good, so useful for me. And head over to what is the probably most interesting gun game, if you could call it that. It's called Mystery Munitions. It's essentially gun game, but uh, on Cold War. We're here, we're rolling a new weapon. It's uncommon rarity. Holy crap, you move so fast in this game compared to BO3. What? I'm so confused. I thought, hmm. I swear that BO3 moved faster, but I mean, this is what it is. There's no round limit. you just gun game, essentially. And eventually you get pack-a-punch weapons, and it's all cool and dandy. You get all sorts of stuff, like this. But it's all based on, I believe, elite surges. So every three surges, you get a brand new weapon. But maybe I'm tripping. Never mind, I'm tripping balls. We get an uncommon baseball bat. <laughs> We go from the Psy into the baseball bat. We now have the AMP-63, AKA a pistol. Uh, so that's great. And we gotta beat a mangler. Why did I want to say Megaton and Mimic, but not mangler? I don't know. I think I'm an idiot. This music is so intense for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> Oh no, I'm getting smacked by this mangler. Holy, you are doing far too much damage for my liking. Man, what the heck? This gun does zero damage, but I can just melee him. And I get a free perk. That's random. If I switch to my fist, will it replace my fist with something instead of my AMP 63? Or am I tripping? I swear that was a thing before. Wow, such cool gameplay, guys. We got another pistol that's uncommon. I'm not gonna stick around on this mode too much. Not because it's terrible, but because it's just not entertaining. The maps that you're playing on, you know, they're the multiplayer maps. That's why Onslaught itself is bad. They added these modes to try and fix the mistake of how terrible Onslaught was in the first place. And it obviously is better because like, you're playing on different maps than Onslaught normally plays. But at the same time, without being able to pick your maps that you're playing on, and without being able to really enjoy this, because three rounds in a row where it's just the same weapons essentially, and you just 
eliminate 10 zombies, flip, eliminate more zombies, flip. It's a cool concept that wasn't ever acted on well, and it even these special game modes on Onslaught are just not that fun. So I'm not going to stick around on this too long because I don't think it's fun. So why would you guys think it's fun to watch? I don't know. But maybe you guys are as psychopathic as me. I don't know. I'd rather just play Roblox Zombies. This is what I'd rather play, guys, because there's a shop, there is all sorts of cool stuff, and a rainbow laser here for 20,000 C, which is coins, obviously. Uh, maybe not obviously, but I feel like it's obvious. I don't know how you get em emeralds, though. That's what I want to know. You can upgrade literally the ray gun and the wonder Waff. so this game's pretty cool. It's called Michael's Zombies, and we're going to jump into some... Joe's gun game. 30 some weapons, and we just gotta get E limbs. Pretty fun, actually. Fast paced, actually. Unlike the start of BO3 games, and just Cold War Onslaught in general. I, I can't, I can't play Onslaught anymore, man. After getting all the intel, I might actually, um, I, I can actually just lose my poop. Alright, take two, guys. I just died on the, the fifth gun, I think that was. Virtual training yet again. And this time, instead of dying on the fifth gun, when there's literally no competition that are setting down mines to eliminate me, uh, we're just gonna be smart and live. But, yeah, I just really enjoy this game. It's maybe not the greatest game ever. Maybe it's the worst game ever to you. But that's cool. I think what the COD Zombies community really sucks about is the fact that they, they hold their opinion so true to their heart, and they make it so that like everyone else they believe has to agree with them because otherwise they're wrong and because they're wrong yeah ha like something like they need to get punished or something i don't know that's just the way y'all act i'm sorry the zombies community in general that's just kind of the way they are they think oh if you don't agree with my opinion you're just stupid and so because you're stupid i won't respect your opinion we all have opinions guys come on just because we're not all the same and we have different opinions does not mean our opinions are less valid. Okay? They're opinions. They're not freaking facts. Now, if we're talking about actual facts here, I can just agree with you that if someone disagrees with a fact, then yeah, they're an idiot. But, I mean, when you're playing Michael Zombies and you're just saying that this is a fun game, that's an opinion, not a fact. So hope you guys just can accept that this is a fun game. Now, this gun game is supposedly, you know, something where you're supposed to be playing, like, with slash against other players, but obviously, I have no friends, so I'm playing by myself. Uh, but there's all sorts of cool power-ups in this, bro. Like, actually, they're wonderful to play and experience with. Because you get fast fire rate, you get speed boost, you get max ammo. It's not just the base normal power-ups and stuff from COD Zombies. You just kind of enjoy yourself, man. And I get the Panzer trick. The Panzer trick. Yes, yes. 18 down to 11. Rapid fire. Reload, reload, reload. I wish there were more perks I could get, though. Uh, during Gun Game. And I wish Gun Game wasn't just on this one map. But there are plenty of maps on this game where you can play both um, fun games, like gun game, or Easter egg based game modes, such as Michael's Zombies maps, such... I, I, it's called like Michael's House or something like that, I don't know. That's the map name. There's also Nocturne Toten. But, like, different, you know, special, not the same as always. Pretty cool. I appreciate it. A lighthouse map that is really cool, and other stuff that's all sorts of just fun to play around with. So if you want to see more, leave a like, sub, and comment down below, and I'll bring y'all more Roblox Zombies content. In the meantime, let's just get promoted. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I've been eliminated by a panzer. Yes, there are panzers in this... Yes, I am dying. And yes, take two. Might end terribly if I don't get him out the way. 
I'm back to the STG finally. Maybe not finally. Oh, I thought I got you dead. I thought I got you dead. Panzer, are you gone now? Oh my gosh, stop it, bro. Get some help. That's not okay. M14. Holy crap. Do you get me down to one hit off that? I can't buy more perks, so... I'm kind of stuck now. Can I, can I knife you? Like, I... I bought a second life! What? I guess there are some issues with this game, but still, it's fun as heck. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see y'all in the next one. We just did three gun games across one video. And I gotta say, this might be the best. At least in my opinion. Deuces.